What do you know about bonsai trees? I only knew from what I saw in the Karate Kid, so not that much. But this weekend, some of the best bonsai trees in the area are on display, and I learned that you can have small ones and big ones just like that. The number of trees that can be bonsai is a good thing, and for some of us, it's a bad thing because it's our addiction. That's Brian Lawrenson, the president of the Milwaukee Bonsai Club. I mean society. Because we're cooler than a club. It's ancient trees. It's cool. This weekend, he and many of his fellow bonsai sculptors are putting their best pieces of art on display at the Linden Sculpture Garden in Milwaukee for the 50th exhibit of the Milwaukee Bonsai Society. It's a free event. It's a combination of being a gardener and being Michelangelo. I had no idea sculpting bonsai trees was so intense. The Karate Kid made it look so easy. But you need to learn a lot more than what Mr. Miyagi can uh, clip off with his scissors. Trees don't grow fast, so it takes years to create these sculptures. Plus, if you snap a branch, that could be a decades-long mistake. What I learned while at the exhibit is so many types of trees can be bonsai trees. This is a redwood, which is one of the tallest species in the world. A bonsai tree is simply a tiny, manicured tree placed in a pot. Trees are cool because it takes a lot of time to get them to look this way. With the exhibit's educational workshops and all the staff on hand, you'll probably learn more about bonsai trees this weekend than you ever thought imaginable. Find more info on TMJ4.com. All of us could go on and on with this stuff. There's a bunch of things. In Milwaukee, James Grow, TMJ4 News.